madness! Oh, nope. Maybe not. A nice watch. This isn't the way. How did I get here? Uh. What did I do? Plot armor? Kind of annoying. I really wouldn't mind getting a lamp right about now. She's afraid of the dark. Uh, <clears throat> what? Yeah. What is it? It's not a watch. Did she have that this whole time? Is the amulet causing all that? I've got the power. Very Lovecraftian. Oh, I like it. Hey, how are you doing? I'm doing it. Is she cheating on her, Salim? I know Salim, and I know you. I know what you're capable of. He'll make it, oh. and you'll get back to him even if all hell stands in your way. That's so fucking sad. I know. Well, sorry. Sorry, YouTube and Kappa. I guess this is not safe for kids anymore. Sorry. Thanks, game. No, I can't monetize these videos. Damn it. Who's singing? Who that? Who that? Papa, listen, don't you cry. Yeah, so far, I'm really enjoying this game. I got to say, take it from me. I'll be honest too if I'm not. If at any point where I don't feel like I'm enjoying the game, I will be vocal about it. So far, I'm actually really enjoying this. Torches. Very, Someone's in here. Very different Hello? from the first one. It, Anyone? I'm not really. I'm not getting any sequelitis here. So far, at least. Well, at least I'm not. I didn't even really play the first one all the way through, but I played a good chunk of the original. What if I still have my old save? I can just go back and... There we go. I'll give you more content for my channel, too. Yeah. Anyway. Um, is this where I fell? Can I get a lantern? No. Ah! The power! This is so strange. All right. Look what I can do! <laughs> Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me do that again. Hey, Mom! Look what I can do! Stuart! How are you doing that, Stuart? Fashioning to. It's another 
realm of existence. It's another dimension. I squeeze through here. Right. Oh, what was the point in that then? Yeah. Go all the way through. Alright. Do I collect anything? Anything at all? No. Alright. Well, whatever. Hmm? I, I was, was able, able to meet them in the park this afternoon after talking to the factory manager, DR. A proud moment. Alice has learned to count to three with her locks. Yay! She did. She did. She showed me. There. In the park. Out here. Yes. And I. That's that's as far as I can go. Damn it. Oh. More out here. Shit. Oh crap. Oh. Oh. Should I not have? Should I? Should I have known? That that was gonna happen or something. Through here, oh, I can't. Joy, don't tell me back to where I started. Oh, Harry, God. Lovecraftian. <laughs> no, those are just the northern lights, it's the Aurora Borealis. Borealis in your kitchen? Or however that goes again. It's team camps. Right before I got here. Uh, <clears throat> well, anyway, what's done is done. Don't sue me for that, please. Uh, well, he, he looks a little preoccupied.
Lo lovely place you got here. Did you uh, did you do the decorating on your own? It's glowing again. Oh, hold on, I gotta read this. Oh no, no voice acting for this one. I, I have to read it. All right. <clears throat> Nothing progresses, time does not change things, light does not move across the sky, nor does it grow dinner, but, I mean, sorry, dimmer or brighter, and yet time must pass. My month is day, and I feel the uh, pangs of hunger. Uh, Weeder's notes predicted instability of the flow of time around the junctions between worlds where one step might carry one between years, but might preserve the body in its current state, or indeed, where the body changed. But, time did not pass for the world around. <laughs> yeah, you know, uh, is that what has happened? Is this whole world frozen in a moment after its destruction? How can I even tell, and what would change if I knew the answer? I have given up on the attempt to find the portal I have a notion that I could apply Wiener's predictions on the weakness of the fabric between worlds if only I could map them in some form. Oh, sorry, you were saying about this thing? I'm not doing anything special. You liar. Put it away. A toy. Okay. It's a tool that helps us cross our dimensions. Get used to it. It's Lovecraft country now. I'm not talking about that crappy Hulu show either. Shit, maybe I should def Oh, okay. I didn't see him. <laughs> so this really is quite the lovely place here. Um, love what you've done with the, uh, the ashes and all the rubble floating in my face. Was I, was I just here? before I go anywhere? Anywhere specific? Probably. Oh, this is... a hint for a puzzle, I'm guessing. Right? Alright, doing it the easy way this time. Damn it. The two reg... call her the Woman of the Tents, or the mother of us all. A local tribe related to the two reg uh, pronunciation on huh? um, the Kenan and Kel Hanan call her the Great Queen. In legend she is Tin Man Hanan, a barber princess who found a source of food in the desert and founded a Turek tribe and started her own barbershop. The mound itself is named for her, and indeed her body may lie within it in the ruins just beneath the surface. But, but, ha, there, there's more, much more to the structure, you see. It is clear that the deeper ruins are Roman, yeah, as we predicted, and there we may find um, mithril set by the Romans to protect the gateway that we seek. <laughs> What's within? What wonders will we see? Uh, wonder. That made sense. Another day in the life. I'm an Australian adventurer. Freaking brave floating my face. She's not losing her mind. She doesn't need a match. Oh, wait, I spoke too soon. Uh oh, it's the madness starting to creep in. Yeah! 
Is she doubting me? She'll just go back to her house. Alright. We can go back. And you're not much for exploration, are you? Penises. Orb. No portal alternative. Rift? Orb. Hmm. What does this say? There are shadows of the dead in the ruins. Those who lived here were human or near it. So perhaps this was Zathura, after all, or Zerzera? Or Eden? or some other stronghold of humanity. But whatever this place once was, it is shattered. These must be, or must have been, the gate builders. But what horror could cause such destruction? Surely, even the shadow cannot destroy a whole world? There is no sign of a portal. Even if I were to find one, the orb is lost in the shadow, and I do not have any other. There is something else here, though, stirring in the fog. I see bright lights as it hunts, and hear its cries. I do not think it's alive, and I definitely don't think it's headlights. This is before automobiles, correct? Come on, take the rope. Let's have a little bondage fun here. Uh -huh. what, what's, what's this? Weak points, but no amulet. A lot of rain. I am defeated. There's no way back. There's nowhere to go. I have searched for a portal, but there is none. I have triangulated the weakest points with Levi's calculations, but I cannot tear a rift. But I can for I do not have a traveler's amulet. I did not heed Renenberg's warning. Yet what choice did I have? The shadow sends the orb. I had to risk it all and step through the portal. There's no water and no other means of sustenance. I'll not live for long. If you, dear reader, tra traveler, damn it, from whatever world you come, if you comprehend. And you know enough. To speak to those called Earth. Let them know this. I was the first to solve the mysteries of the gate builders. Mm, yeah, I was. I was the first human to breach the boundaries between worlds. I, Professor Thurston Aloysius Herbert of Cambridge, England, was the first. God forgive me. And now I'm dead. Blech. This is you, Worked out quite well for you. Although we don't worry, you brought your plot armor, you're good. Follow the amulet. 
The red balloon. Follow the red balloon. Jason! Yeah, I've completely lost my mind. I read this already, right? Yes. No, no, I'm in the light. Good, safe, I'm in the light. Stare at the light. Stare at it. Right here. 